Oh, open this up very carefully. You guys, I'm always afraid to do this. Are you afraid to do this? Oh, no, I'm trying to pop it. Oh, I did it. Ah, look at that, those cinnamon rolls. I'm gonna put that right there like that. Now for this cinnamon roll recipe, I'm going to add pumpkin and I'm gonna cut these in half. You know, like you make a monkey bread. Have you ever made that? I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna cut them and they're gonna be small. And then it's almost gonna make like a casserole. I'll just do that, it's simple, easy. What a wonderful thing to wake up to, cinnamon rolls in the morning. Can there be anything better? I don't know. I'm gonna do that and we're just gonna cut them up. And then I'm gonna spread them on the bottom. Doesn't have to be perfect. Whoop, that one, let's rip him apart. And look at that. It's gonna be so good. I'm gonna take the second tube. There's usually eight in a tube. And I'm gonna do the same thing. So I've added the second tube of the crescent rolls. Remember they're the cream cheese. Has the cinnamon, has all the yummy, delicious spices already done. And with this, you get these little cream cheese frosting tops. So I'm gonna put that out and this will melt right in to the cinnamon rolls. And I'm just gonna do that, gonna go around. This is gonna be so yummy. And I'm just gonna smush that around, get it going. Like I said, doesn't have to be perfect. It's gonna melt together and gonna be delicious and all over the corners. There we go. Keep going. Keep pushing down. Keep mixing it together. It's going to be so good. Get the corners. It was soft, so I didn't have to really melt it or anything. It's going to melt right into everything. And then next, I'm going to add, got a can of pumpkin pie, but I'm not going to use it. It's the pure pumpkin. It's gonna taste like pumpkin pie. And I'm just gonna do this right over the top. Like I said, this is just an easy morning cinnamon roll. But since I'm craving pumpkin lately, I'm gonna add this, put that to the side. And that is gonna help mix that frosting. And we're gonna add a twist at the end. I always like to add my own little twist. And look at that. You can, oh, it smells so good. Who doesn't love cinnamon rolls in the morning? I used about a half. I'm just gonna scrape that other half out, get all the corners, delicious. And then I'm gonna take my pumpkin pie spice and I'm just gonna sprinkle that over the top. There's no really measuring with this. It's kind of eyeball. Do what you want. You can add, look at that. I'm just gonna incorporate that again and mix it together and just get all the corners. Oh my goodness. This is gonna be so delicious. And we're gonna bake this. Look at your crescent roll, but I'm gonna bake it 350 for about 15 minutes. So I've taken this out of the oven and now I'm going to add my little extra ingredient. I'm gonna add, I melted this down, just mic it for a few seconds, get it nice creamy. This is why I was not worried about the other frosting touching every corner because I knew I was gonna add this. So again, if you like pecan, coconut, I'm gonna drizzle this on top, get it on the corners, and just do it right out of the little package here. You don't have to dirty up another plate. And this is coconut, pecan, frosting. I'm gonna get it on the corners, oh my gosh. Oh, How does that smell? It <laughs> just smells unbelievable. Your two favorite things, cinnamon rolls and pecans and coconut, or three. <laughs> oh, look at this. So you can get all those corners. You know, this isn't for every day. This is for those special occasions or mornings. We always have cinnamon rolls during the holidays in the morning. So we're just getting a jump start. Look at that. Oh my gosh, if you could smell that, you guys, it's wonderful. I'm gonna put it back in the oven and just let that kind of get all sticky and gooey on the top and that's gonna be in there for about a minute or so, just real quick. So we took this out of the oven 
and we let that cook a little bit longer, maybe a minute and a half, two minutes, not too long. And remember, I added this, I just melted that in the microwave, just poured the coconut pecan frosting over that, that gives it a top layer, and it is gonna be delicious, it's hot, so be very careful. And I am going to, I think, cut into that, it sat a few minutes. Look at this, oh my gosh. You guys, this is amazing. Look at that. You see that? Well, I can really smell it now. It's the creaminess of the pumpkin that melted down in there. I'm going to keep digging that corner out. Look at that. And it's like a monkey bread, but in a long pan. Sometimes I can't get my monkey breads out of the bunt. So anyway, there we go. It's my version, cream cheese, pumpkin, cinnamon roll, and okay. my extra little addition, coconut pecan. We're gonna the, taste this. The coffee's ready. The coffee's ready. Get the coffee on. Make sure you don't burn yourself, I can't wait. Oh my gosh. You have to try this. So good. Enjoy.